There have been a lot of questions recently about cicadas. You're asking, where are they? You've heard they were going to be prolific this year, but you haven't seen many. So we put the question to an entomologist with the Smithsonian Institution's Museum of Natural History. First question, will there be a lot of cicadas this year? They'll see a few this year, but they'll see thousands next year. Shockley says annual cicadas are out every year, including this year. There are multiple species that are out at slightly different times, but generally from May to September. But next year, the 17-year periodical cicadas are what everyone will be talking about in our region. You won't have a hard time finding them. This is expected to be a really big emergence event. So, what's the difference between the annual and the periodical cicadas? Well, periodical cicadas are often referred to by brood. This year, brood nine emerged in West Virginia, North Carolina, and the western portion of Virginia. But it's a much smaller population than brood 10, the great eastern brood, which is the brood of the periodical cicada we're going to see next year. You might see a few brood 10 cicadas pop up early in D.C. this year, and there's a reason for that. Uh, that's actually how periodical cicada broods uh, come into existence, is you get enough stragglers coming out at the same time, uh, and they breed, and that makes them off by one year from the brood to which they actually belong. Almost every brood has stragglers that show up a year before or a year after. According to Shockley, you can easily tell periodical cicadas from annual cicadas. Periodical cicadas have black bodies, orange wings, and orange eyes and they're also a little bit smaller than the annual cicadas that are out every year. Shockley says annual cicadas, like those you will see this year, are typically tan and black or green and black camouflage colored with clear or greenish wings. When the temperatures are particularly warm, they show up a little sooner. Most of the annual cicadas are just starting to come out now, uh, and their numbers will increase over uh, July and August. And those numbers start to decline in September, depending on temperatures. Shockley says all cicadas, whether annual or periodical, come out to mate and lay eggs so they don't live very long as adults, only about a month. Now, while this year will be relatively quiet, next year will be a different story with much of the East Coast seeing brood 10. It's one of the largest broods of periodical cicadas. Uh, in the U.S. and it's going to affect uh, most of the D.C. area and the surrounding areas. So it's going to uh, affect Delaware, parts of Pennsylvania, uh, Maryland, Virginia, West Virginia, uh, all at the same time. 